When it comes to working with fiber optic cable, one of the things we hear about is fusion splicing, but we don't always get to see it in action. So in this case, let's take a look at how we fusion splice a couple of fibers together. We'll begin by stripping the fiber. In this case, I'm using a thermal stripper to strip the jacket off of the fiber so that we can get down to the fiber in the cladding. Next, I'll put it in the cleaver. Now the cleaver doesn't actually cut the fiber, it breaks it. By breaking the glass, we get a very clean cut on the end of the fiber. Next, I will put it into the fusion splicer. Now this is a core alignment fusion splicer. So when we start the fusion splicing process, it'll align the two fibers. Once the fibers are aligned, it'll use an electric arc to melt the glass together. Now, this connection has a good optical loss. It's not very mechanically sound. So what we do is we slip a heat shrink sleeve over it that has a stainless steel pin in it, and we put it in the heater. This will shrink that heat shrink tubing down and provide a good mechanical connection where we splice the fibers together. Once the splicing is done, it is put into a splice tray inside the patch panel, and now it's ready to go. The big advantage of fusion splicing is it provides a low loss, mechanically sound connection between our two fibers.